You're listening to the Chapter a Day Audio Bible. I'm John Stonge, and today we're in Jeremiah chapter 47. And we'll be reading from the Contemporary English Version. Before the king of Egypt attacked the town of Gaza, the Lord told me to say to the Philistines, I, the Lord, tell you that your land will be flooded with an army from the north. It will destroy your towns and sweep you away, moaning and screaming. When you hear the thunder of horses and chariots, your courage will vanish, and parents will abandon their own children. You refugees from Crete, your time has now come, and I will destroy you. None of you will be left to help the cities of Tyre and Sidon. The Anakim who survive in Gaza and Ashkelon will mourn for you by shaving their heads and sitting in silence. You ask how long will I continue to attack you with my sword? Then you tell me to put it away and leave you alone. But how can my sword rest when I have commanded it to attack Ashkelon and the seacoast? Let's pray. Lord, we thank you for your word, and we thank you for the fact that everything you tell us is true. Lord, time and again, you warn the people living during Jeremiah's time that they were going to experience judgment because of their disbelief and because of their rebellion against you. Lord, time and time again, you had sent your prophets to them, and through those prophets, you pleaded with them, but they rejected you just the same. And we can see the consequences of those decisions playing out throughout the course of this book. Lord, in many ways, we're in the same exact situation. Time and time again, through your prophets who wrote down the scriptures, you have been pleading with humanity to trust in your son, Jesus Christ, receive the gift of forgiveness by faith, enjoy the blessings of your wrath being removed from upon us, and walk in confidence knowing that we are part of your eternal family. Lord, that's your offer to us. And even still, there are those who scoff at that offer because they prefer to go their own way. But by your grace, Lord, we pray that you would plead with our minds and plead with our hearts, that you'd help us to see that we need your Son, Jesus Christ, and that we would walk with you faithfully each and every day. We thank you, Lord, for the examples and the reminders and the teaching that you give to us from your word. We pray that we would take it to heart, and we commit this day to your care, and pray this all in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you again for listening to the Chapter a Day Audio Bible. If you're listening to this episode at the time it was published, I'd encourage you to stop by Amazon.com where you can download a free copy of our 365-day devotional, Desire Jesus One Year Edition. I've spent the past year putting this devotional together, and it just went live on Amazon the other day. And for several days, they have the Kindle edition available for free download, and you can read it on any device as long as you have the Kindle app. It's also available in paperback, but like I said, if you'd like a free digital Kindle edition, stop by Amazon.com and search for Desire Jesus One Year Devotional. Thanks again for listening, and I hope you have a wonderful day.